guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Tess and I live in Atlanta with my husband and our three cats, Baby Lobster, Pungy, and Huey. I am a first grade teacher, but in my free time, what I like to do to relax is clean, which I realize sounds completely crazy, but I just really appreciate a well-organized, peaceful home. So today what I've got for you is a Grove Collaborative Hall. And for you cleaning addicts out there that are like me, Grove is your go-to spot for the best natural and non-toxic cleaning product. So if you're unfamiliar with Grove, it's an online company. They sell lots of different brands, including their own, but they're really focused on sustainable and non-toxic items. So I'm gonna show you what I got. I already broke into it a little bit. I couldn't wait. And I'm gonna let you know what I like and then I'll let you know later how these actually all work out for me. So let's get right into it. The first item, I'm actually quite surprised to see this. Oops, sorry guys. These are the Seedling by Grove. That's their paper products company. Um, the ultra absorbent paper towels. They are new and improved, stronger and faster absorbing. And these are tree-free products made of 100% sustainable bamboo. Now I'm surprised that they were in my box because I had put them in my cart and it said that they were sold out. No kidding, I couldn't get paper products anywhere. It's impossible these days. So I'm actually really grateful to see these because that guy over there is the last man standing. So let's check these out. So we've got two jumbo rolls. They're a decent size. I don't know if I'd say jumbo. It's soft, for sure soft. They're not as thick as maybe like a brawny or a bounty, um, but I am interested in trying them. We'll give it a try, we'll give it a go and see if they are as absorbent as some of the leading competitors. I'm wondering if they're gonna really hold up two messes, but worst case scenario, I could just use them in the bathroom for wiping the toilet or um, cleaning the glass of mirrors. So these are the Seedling by Grove paper towels. Oh, and what an interesting fact. It says every 50 rolls purchased equals one tree planted. So it's sustainable and that they are replanting trees after they chop them down. All right, next item. This is one of my bathroom buddies. This is the Method Anti-Bac Toilet Bowl Cleaner. It's an antibacterial toilet cleaner and this is in the scent Spearmint. To my knowledge, it only comes in the spearmint scent. What I love about this, it is distinctly different from what you guys have been using before. I know my whole life up until about two years ago, I was using Clorox or Lysol, whatever you can grab in the grocery store, and they just kind of stink. They're a weird blue or green goo. I mean, this is blue, but it's not weird. It's wonderful. What I like about this is that it sticks nicely to the side of the toilet bowl. It foams up really well also, and it smells extremely refreshing. It's kind of like when you start chewing gum and you feel that like vibrant, clean, fill your mouth. This is what it's like when you get this guy in the toilet bowl and you start working with it. And I love pairing it with the anti back bathroom cleaner, the spray, which I think I've gotten here too. So this is a go-to product for me, one of my favorites for sure. All right, next. Oh, I'm interested in trying this. So I love Method products, but I mostly use them in the bathroom uh, as well as their soap. So I really like their dish soap. This is the Method All-Purpose Naturally Derived Surface Cleaner. This is in lime and sea salt, and it's with non-toxic plant-based power green technology. Now, I don't know what that means, but if it gets my surfaces clean in a natural way and it's safe for my pets, then I'm all for it. So this is going to be used in the kitchen, mostly on the countertops, as well as the stove top and in the microwave. Guys, I didn't smell it. That's like the best part. What are you thinking? Okay. You definitely get the lime, but it's not as pungent maybe as it could be. You don't get like an acidic punch from it. I think it's probably that sea salt that rounds that out a little bit. It reminds me of a day at the beach, you know, when you leave and you can still smell the beach on you a little bit, but not like the funky kind, like the sea salt that's still kind of lingering in your hair and making it look lovely and wavy. Get those beach waves. That's kind of what this is reminding me of. All right, let's see what else we have. Oh, okay. So we have the Mrs. Meyers Multi-Surface Everyday Cleaner. This is in the Honeysuckle scent. 
Now I have used this product before. I've not used honeysuckle. I had it in the geranium. I did like it. It didn't leave too much of a residue. I do want to give this guy a smell. It's nice. It's definitely floral, but it's not like blowing my mind with like walking into a, a flower shop. You know, when you can walk in, like a Yankee Candle store, you walk and you're like, whoa, whoa, your senses are overwhelmed. It's definitely more mellow. I think this is like a great spring and summertime scent. So again, this will be used in the kitchen, on countertops, the dining room table, the stovetop, as well as the microwave. You know I love my Mrs. Myers, especially in all of the wonderful scents. My next item. Oh, so these came recommended. So these are the Grow Collaborative Microfiber All-Purpose Cloths. And this is a two pack in the Periwinkle Blue. So this came recommended by my sister. So if you've used microfiber before for washing your car or anything, they kind of stick to your fingers in this weird way. It reminds me a little bit of Velcro. You know how you have that side that has like the hooks and then you have the fluffy side? The microfiber cloths to me always feel like the Velcro side with the hooks and then my hand is the fluffy side and it's trying to like attack my hand and I don't like it. It feels really weird. What I really enjoy about these so far, and this is what my sister said, they're super soft, but the fibers are not sticking to my fingers. They also have like a pocket right here where you can stick your fingers if you're really trying to get a deep clean, especially on like the stove top where gunk really gets cooked on, you can attack it really nicely with this. Um, what I love about cloths like these is that you can use them and then once they start to get really icky and icky, just throw it into the wash and they're good to go. Especially these days, it's so difficult to come across paper products, right? So this is a great alternative that you'll be able to use over and over and over again. These do come in three different colors. Um, so I know there's the periwinkle, which is what I selected. They also had like a sea foam or like a minty green and a gray. So I was thinking about getting another pack and then color coding depending on their use. So maybe the periwinkle would be used for wiping toilets or the seafoam green could be used for wiping counters or something like that. So I'm interested in using these and I'll let you know how these go. Next, let's see what we've got. Guys, okay, this is a little weird of me, but I saw this on Grove's website. It's the Mrs. Meyers dish soap. I've used tons of their dish soap, right? It's a product that I love. Apple cider is one of my favorites that comes out in the fall as well as basil. And this is the fresh cut grass set. And I saw it and I thought, it's also exclusive to Grove. What a bizarre scent. Like who sat down and thought, fresh cut grass guys, that's gonna be our next bestseller. So I'm curious because I've never smelled this before. And this could go one of two ways. It's either gonna smell like dirt, like you're sticking your head inside of those, um, you know those bags that you put out by the curb that you put like your leaves and your cut grass in? It's either gonna smell like you're shoving your head in that or it's gonna be light and crisp and I'm going to be pleasantly surprised. So let's try it. That's actually really clean. It doesn't smell like dirt at all. It doesn't smell like fresh cut grass either. That has like a really distinct smell. It doesn't smell like that. It just, it kind of smells like clean laundry. Like when you get your, um, you get your clothes and you hang them on the line and you go up, they're blowing in the wind, right? And the sun is caressing them and you give it a, give it a good sniff. That's sort of what it smells like. So I'm not sure where the fresh cut grass smell name came from, but hey, this guy smells great. Okay, oh, I'm really excited about this. Is it weird that I get excited about cleaning stuff? I mean, you guys are here listening to me, so I can't be that strange. This is the Method Fragrance Boosters, and this is in the Ginger Mango scent. Now, this is another product I have not tried. I have tried and I do use currently the Ginger Mango Laundry Detergent, and I love it. It smells fantastic. But this weird thing happens when I do laundry. Um, in fact, my husband won't let him, won't let me do his laundry because every time I wash clothes, even if I take them out as soon as the washer stops, they just smell kind of like mildewy and damp. 
it just has like a like a raw sort of smell that lingers. It's just not that pleasant. And whenever he does his laundry, he uses fabric softener and it smells fantastic. So I thought he's doing something different, let me try. So I've been interested in trying these. So these are the, these are the ginger mango. It smells just like the laundry detergent. I also have their dryer sheets. It's really bright. It's a nice um, balance between the ginger and the mango. I'm excited to try these and see how they fix that laundry issue of mine. Um, so it says you just pour the boosters into the top of the cap. So this is gonna be like your little measure. Use at least two capfuls. Then you're gonna toss it right onto the clothes before you start the wash and that's it. So I'll let you know how these guys go and they have tons of different scents. I just know that I like the ginger mango. All right, we're getting to the bottom guys. Here's, this is a freebie actually. One of the great things about Grove is that once you spend a certain amount, not only do you get free shipping, but they toss in free gifts and you often get to choose from a, a few different options what your gift is. So these are the Rooted Beauty Sensitive Facial Towelettes and they have aloe and chamomile and there are 30 towelettes in here. So I selected these because I'm just like not really a makeup person. I'm not a skincare routine person. I'm just far too lazy for that. I just wanna go to bed at night. I don't wanna put anything on my face. So I thought this might be a good alternative. It might help me out. I wanna try it out and it was free. It says perfect for travel, gym bags. I don't have a gym bag. That would require me to go to the gym. And life on the go. So I'll try these out and let you guys know how they go. It says get clean glowing skin anywhere, anytime with our gentle facial towel lifts. Well, we'll see. And it says they are for sensitive skin. My skin like kind of freaks out sometimes. So we'll see how these guys go. All right, are you ready for it? Last but not least, we have, this is one of my favorites. The Method Anti-Back Bathroom Cleaner in its glory. This guy, I say like these are my bathroom duos, my bathroom buddies, you have to have them together. What I love about this guy is that it kills, once again, 99.9% .9 of household germies and it smells great. You don't have that gross smell of bleach as you're working. So the anti-back, this is in spearmint. It also comes in citron. I have tried the citron. I just happen to prefer the spearmint. It's just really fresh. It is like that spa experience. Not that I'm going to the spa, like what first grade teacher can afford going to the spa? Not this girl. But this is how I can get my little spa aromatherapy treatment in. My bathroom duo. So I would highly recommend this one. So guys, that's all I have. I've got all of my Grove goodies. I'm super excited about trying some of these new ones out, especially my microfiber cloths and some of my all surface cleaners. If you guys have tried any of these products, or if you're a Grove gal or guy just like me, not the guy, the gal part, and you have some products that you think I should try, go ahead and comment down below so that I can start exploring some of the other wonderful things about Grove. If you liked this video and you were looking for more cleaning motivation, meal prep, and cooking and baking tips, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. And until next time, my friends, happy cleaning.